So my name is William Cotton and I'm studying for a PhD in the Department of Radiological Sciences. Um, I currently study pain in terms of the topic for my PhD, but I studied the master's course in translational neuroimaging uh, two years ago. So currently we're down in the A floor of the QMC within the med school and behind me we've got the 1.5 Tesla scanner. We also have a 3 Tesla scanner just across the way um, and this is where we do all of our scanning. I chose Notium because for me the course was right, it, it was clinically aimed, so it was predominantly aimed as, it, you know, that's why it's called translational neuroimaging. We want to perform research that has an outcome for the patients, improving diagnosis. Um, Notium also specifically because I knew the university had a big reputation in terms of MR scanning, you know, having the Sir Peter Mansfield Centre here as well, and it just really had the reputation as one of the leading places to study MR. So in terms of facilities for the master students, there's currently a what we call a master, the master's lab room, which is basically just a, a room full of computers dedicated for the master's students to come in. It's got a specific software for analysing the MR data. Probably one of the major kind of benefits for studying here for me was that when it came around to the individual research project, I was able to start my own study from scratch. Another highlight of studying within this department and within the University of Nottingham generally, is we get quite a lot of guest lecturers, whether they're in a department or over at Psychology or the Sir Peter Mansfield Centre. There's a lot going on to try and keep you up to date with the research that's going on and possibly even influence you know, a research project or, uh, during the Masters. Um, so in regards to the staff that teach the course, it's a real mix of kind of clinical lecturers, you know, so reporting radiologists who can take us through what we're seeing on the images to uh, MR physicists um, who obviously explain w what we're seeing and why. Um, but then we also have kind of practicing researchers. So, you know, they're showing us up to date techniques, um, you know, ways to analyze the images that have, you know, just been, just been designed. So it's kind of a real mix. And yeah, I think one of the really nice things is how open the staff are to kind of helping you out as a student. You know, the doors, doors are always open. You know, even if you think it's a silly question, you know, they're never going to laugh you away because, you know, they're just so passionate about what they're doing. So the course is kind of enabled really to try and let people study past it. So for me, it's certainly allowed me to progress on to studying a PhD um, and it's equipped me with the kind of the tools and the knowledge to, to start that successfully and really hit the ground running.